This video is about divinations, and the Lord put it on my heart today to talk about divinations, specifically those individuals that like to read tables. Now, tables are like those people who do tarot cards, and back in 2012 and 13, I give you my testimony about the table that I tried to read, and I was not a saved Christian at the time. I was saved to follow Jesus in 2015. Now, divinations today, they're in the mystical, they're in the spiritual realm, and people use physical objects here and now to contact beings, spirits, spiritual beings in another dimension. Now, if you want to get out of divination and follow Jesus Christ, then you must repent. And you must repent of tabletop worship. You're making tables. You're putting out your cards, your tarot cards. In my case, I had a blanket that I was trying to read. And very terrible things happened to me. Now, the Lord said to me that this was spiritual table dancing in the spiritual realm. This is something that God hates. Especially because you're letting demons, strange entities, spirits come into your body, into your mind, and mingle themselves with you. There's different kinds of divination. I'll put a link in the bottom if you want to take a look at the contents there. A list from A to Z, you'd be very surprised at how many different kinds of divination there is and what people are willing to worship to get spirit contact. And so this spiritual tabletop dancing is necromancy, is divination. There's different kinds. Today, basically, there is the tarot reading. There is Torah codes, Gamachia, Kabbalists, and their number worship, Gamachia. And this is how they reach their spiritual scope of enlightenment. These methods are mystical and they don't lead to Jesus Christ. So for those individuals who wish to come out of divination and tarot reading, Torah codes, Kabbalism, or Kabbalah, the mystic of Gamachia, different kinds, I can go over a few that are listed. But there's a whole list from A to Z. It's worth taking a look at for a moment. Some people worship James. That's in here too as well. These are all ways of seeking a mystical conception, a joining together of the spirit with the physical. I wanted to bring this to your attention that many people practice different kinds of divination and they deny the only way to God, Jesus Christ. 
now is the time to cry out to the Lord and repent. Get to know who He is. He will tell you what your thoughts are. He will tell you exactly what you're thinking. This is what He did to me in 2015 when I repented and got serious. He changed my life. He told me all that which I was thinking before I thought it in a moment's time. And he came upon me and showed me who he was. And when people search for prophecies in tarot cards, in divination, in making tables, any kind of tables, that is demon worship. That is worshiping lines and books, spirits and technology, artistry, images, that's all evil and dead. There's nothing spiritual about it. And if you wish to come to the Lord, I want to encourage you to stop doing that. Come to know the truth in a pure sense, and that is through prayer. That is the way to the Lord, only through prayer. There are many avenues that lead to hell, a wicked hell. It is all listed here in this list here of methods of divination. All that leads to hell. The only way to truth is through the Holy Spirit. You could repent of being a tabletop spiritual dancer with demons, with devils, with entities in the spirit world that really have no light in them. That's all dead. That's all darkness. May your prayers come to Jesus.